How's it going everybody? This is Vita Bush. Today, we're going to talk about how to properly use probiotics. When you go to the store, you have a lot of probiotics that you can choose from. A lot of times they're quite expensive. You have the pills kind, you have yogurt, you have yogurt, any form of which would claim a lot of different useful purposes. So with the packaging claiming certain things, it's up to the consumer to figure out which one is which, which one is useful and not. Recently, I came upon this website called usprobioticguide.com. There's also a Canadian version of this. What this website does is it aggregates all the scientific studies and marks which product does exactly what. Certain strains of probiotics are good for addressing certain issues, such as maybe Yokult is good for boosting your immune system, or other strains is good for addressing irritable bowel syndromes. Now, I'm not an expert at all the different strains of probiotics, but if I need to figure out which strain to take, it would be good to go to this website to figure out which problems you have and then you go look up which products that addresses this and if you see there's a level one indicator there it means they have scientific backing that yes this product when done in a scientific setting it does help for certain conditions this is way better than the product packaging or the marketing materials that will claim certain things. A lot of people are going kind of crazy about probiotics. They'll go and ingest as much of that stuff as they can. They go, oh, I have this, this shake or something that has probiotic, this pill that they have. And then it says, oh yeah, it has more billions of cultures or something. So then they look for the most cultures and it's oftentimes more expensive when there's more cultures it goes like by billions and they're not looking at which strain and which scientific studies would actually correspond to that strain and if that will actually help them you might be just taking a strain that's addressing a different need that you have maybe you have irritable bowel syndrome and then you take a different strain that addresses something else so you might be wasting your money that way if you have a certain condition you want to address with probiotics you may want to check out their website down in the video description below it's called usprobioticguide.com. They also have a Canadian version, which I'm gonna put in the video description below as well. If you're interested in supporting my channel, don't forget to check out my Audible link down in the video description below. You can also support my channel directly through my Patreon link over here. Don't forget to give me a like on this video, comment down below, let me know if you're already taking probiotics and it's also confirmed by scientific studies for what you're taking it for. And of course, don't forget to subscribe over here. Thanks for watching.